Okay. Thank you very much for the large turnout again. And uh, last time, last year, at the same month, here at the same stage, I made a promise to, to you. And that promise is, oh, where is my uh, presentation? <laughs> Can we turn on the presentation? Yeah. It's a long promise. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, just the uh, entire desktop. Okay. Yeah. Entire desktop. Oh. Ah, yeah. Now, now we're rolling. And what I'm, I promise is that I want to write this novel of mine about the dystopian future and make a movie out of it with Gen AI. But I have to disappoint you, I didn't do it. But, 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 I wrote three other books, okay? And I'm going to talk uh, a little bit about the books that I wrote and how I wrote them. Uh, and I'm going to demonstrate to you live in hopefully 30 minutes uh, so that we can, I can write a book in front of you completely and publish it on Amazon. You want to try it? 30 minutes, okay? I have three minutes to present to you a little bit about the books that I already did before. So let's quickly... Okay. So this book, mostly written by me, <laughs> is just a little bit written by ChatGPT in which he is basically... This, I wrote this um, poem in German a couple of years ago. And what I did is I used um, ChatGPT to translate it. So let me, let me just show you here the translation of this poem here. This is another poem. From, from, so the original was in English about rain. And the, the translation was on the same topic, but in German. And the translation, you know, I thought, I have to touch it up, I have to, you know, kind of make amends, I have to edit it. But after I wrote, I, I read what ChatGPT spit out, I actually just kept it. It's, um, it's very well written, and I couldn't have done it better. So what I did is, I basically went through the entire repertoire of my uh, past poetry, and, and used it, uh, used ChatGPT to translate it into different language. So this is one capability that I, that I used ChatGPT for. And the other one is, uh, let me just try to give you, oh, one second. Here we go. Huh? Ah, here we go. So, so what I did is, uh, it's a little bit philosophical, and I, I put basically the ranking of, uh, of my philosophical thought into ChatGPT, and I told ChatGPT to rank it uh, in a way that Kant would do it. Right, the German philosopher Kant. And it actually gave a really good answer, which, which I, before I used ChatGPT to do it, I did it myself, and I thought, okay, this is probably what Kant would do. And it came out exactly the same. I mean, it's just probably subjective, but um, I, I, kept, I kept what uh, ChatGPT did. And what I also did, which is really uh, saving a lot of my time, is after I wrote the entire book, on politics, and uh, this is like about uh, U.S. and tra uh, China trade war. Um, what I did is I, I didn't want to write the conclusion. It, it was boring because you know I had to just summarize the text, and it, it will take time. And I, I just want to publish the book. So what I did is I copy pasted the entire book into ChatGPT, and I told it to write the conclusion for me in my own voice, so in my own writing style. And it, it spit out the conclusion, and I, I kept it completely. 
because it, it was literally my style. I couldn't write it better. It's, it's crazy. And, and that took two minutes. And I just copy-pasted that, and I was ready, and I published the book. Right? So otherwise, maybe I, I would have pro procrastinated. Okay, so we don't have too much time, so 29 minutes. Let's start, shall we start with the writing the book part? Yeah? You want to do it? Okay, let's do it. Okay. Whew. Let me just catch some breath. <laughs> it's, it's actually going to be a marathon, uh, actually a sprint, sorry. So, okay, I prepared for you the seed prompt. So from tho for those who was here last time, I talked about seed prompt, right? So what is a seed prompt? It's basically the prompt that you seed the chat with. And what I told ChatGPT to do is become my writing partner to help me to write this book about the British history, British Empire, the history of British Empire, okay? So what I'm going to do is I prepared, I, I was cheating a bit, because I, I had to prepare some prompts, so I am faster. Um, so what I did is, I prepared this prompt here. I'm gonna copy-paste that. And then while it's ready, uh, okay, hiccup. We don't have internet connection. <laughs> <laughs> what, what's the password again? What open 2024 20, capital? Okay, so now 28 minutes, 22 seconds. 2024, 20, yeah, you said okay. Please don't play tricks with me, okay? Uh, 20, it's 28 minutes. I don't have much time. Okay. I love this live demo. Always goes wrong. Okay, you know what? I'm going to use my phone. <laughs> okay. My phone never abandons me. It only has one bar. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is going really well. Okay. Um, right. Ah, we send it off. Okay. So what, what, what I did here is I seeded the prompt, and then the second prompt I said, please help me to draft the content of the index of the book. Right? So I want to have the content, table of content finished first. So I have a structure to work with. After that structure is done, I'm going to just tell it, um, write the book from chapter one to chapter whatever. Okay? So the title is History of the British Empire from the Viewpoint of the Conquered. I forgot, you know, like most often you have history about uh, some empire, but it's, it's always in the viewpoint of the empire. So why not, uh, let's write this uh, about the conquered. So, okay, what happens is, uh, context, so here's the content index. So it came up with an introduction, a new perspective on the empire, uh, the origins of the empire, the apex of the empire, the decline of the empire, etc. Okay, so now we have part four, so that's, that's altogether six parts, right? Conclusion, introduction, plus four. So what we're going to do, is it is a book about the okay so let me just just do this continue writing this book so with the entire introduction of this book with at least a thousand words right so i'm letting it writing write the introduction now because i have the structure so it's knows the structure, so now it's writing up just the introduction. So I'm going to copy-paste that. Uh, it's still writing. So let me just get rid of this, get rid of that. Okay, so I already cheated a little bit. I prepared the template. This will take some time because, you know, you have to make it pretty and stuff like that. So offers forward will be done last because I will just, you know, tell it this is the book. Just give me the forward. <sighs> yes, it's amazing. I'm telling you. Okay, um, <clears throat> let's go up there. So it's, it's, it's more than a thousand words, I believe. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy paste that. Okay, copy paste. And that's it. Uh, the, you know, like uh, I'm going to do this. Uh, let me just, just say, I think this is pretty, pretty decent. Let me just see 
we can make it, yeah, okay, so this is just decent. Let's just keep that. Okay, purpose of the book, correcting voice, etc. And now what, what, what are we gonna do? We are going to repeat the same thing with the same prompt. So I already prepared that. Uh, so let me just see what that was, chapter. This is just a text ex expander. So I, I just say, okay, so the same prompt, I'm expanding it, I'm putting the variable, I'm saying chapter one, right? So the next chapter, chapter one with, with at least 3,000 words. So now he, it knows from the previous context that it should write a chapter about the early days of the empire, okay? So now we're gonna just, uh, it, it's writing it out for me. So let me just have a look here. I'm just gonna copy paste the chapter's um, title and then paste uh, whatever it wrote here into the chat, uh, into the word. So it's still writing, it takes some, some time. At, at the same time, I want to already prepare for the cover of the book. <laughs> right, and there are, there are tools out there, it costs you $12 a month um, to, to, to pay for the subscription. I'm not, I'm, I'm not a salesman of Leonardo, okay? I'm, 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 just, I'm just stating the fact here. So it, it, it's very cheap, and you can uh, uh, create pictures with prompts. So let's just say, um, so what's that? So let's generate this one. We already I already generated it, just to be sure. But I'm gonna re regenerate to tell you that this is actually working in live demo. And uh, the prompt here is uh, 18th century London Trafalgar Square, crowd of people, James Cook speaking in front of the public with a wide view and large blue sky. And now it's gonna generate that for me. And I'm going to use that picture as my cover. And I just probably saved, I don't know, two weeks time bouncing emails back and forth with someone on Fiverr who is gonna you know, generate that for me in the future, uh, in the past. So, okay, let's just say, okay, okay, that, that's actually nice. I probably just keep this one. I'm gonna click on here. I'm gonna download this. Make sure that it's <laughs> saved properly. Uh, let's just say uh, cover. And then, oh, sorry. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted. So, British Empire, desktop, cover, let's put it here to be organized. So this is the cover, I'm gonna use that as the cover. I'm going to go to Amazon already because I want to publish it within 22 minutes. I'm gonna go to create. I have to fill in, fill in a form. Uh, so it's going to be a Kindle book. Okay, let's make sure that Kindle Create is open because you need that to create a Kindle book. Uh, okay, it's English. We know the title. We're going to put the title in here. We're going to put the subtitle in here. And we're going to uh, put the edition number one, primary offer, ChatGPT. You didn't get that joke, did you? No, don't fake it. <laughs> I, I own the copyright and I hold the necessary publishing right. I, I believe so. <laughs> uh, no, no I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna say that word. Um, so minimum age, choose categories. Okay, oh, it's very easy. I'm gonna go for history. I'm gonna go for, what is it? Oh God, it would take another minute for this. Europe and... I, I'm just gonna go for general, okay? Uh, but you get the idea, when you have more time, you can do this. Um, British Empire. Uh, so history. European history. Um, uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask ChatGPT. I, I ran out of ideas. Okay, <laughs> so <laughs> let's just uh, Norman Conquest. Okay, let's go to, uh, down to here. Uh, where is it? Come on. That's the word. Okay, let's just copy paste that. Okay, and I'm not gonna even look at it. So let's go back, and then we do repeat, rinse and repeat. Okay, this is the rinse and repeat. Chapter two. And now you get into this, like now it's repetitive. Now you can pay someone on Fiverr 
to do this for you, right? You just give them the instructions. You have the prompts. You give the instructions, and, and they will churn out every day 10 books for you, and you pay them, I don't know, you agree on, on a price, I don't know, $100, $100 or something, and you have 10 books every day, something like that, right? Okay, so let's just do chapter two, age of expansion. This is a trick to make it the format stick. Okay, so let's just, I think it's still writing. Yeah, okay. So we have that already, so we're gonna close that. Uh, we're gonna go back to here. I still have no idea about the keywords. Okay, well, I'm, go I'm gonna wait for that. So, conclusion. Probably, probably don't need that conclusion because it's just a chapter. Let's just go to here, period. Okay, perfect. Stick to that. Now, we're finished with the um, chapter two. I hope I have a chapter three here. Yes, I have a chapter three. And let's just rinse and repeat. Uh, open Slava was, was, was the, okay, chapter three, right? So let it write. Okay, let me just uh, just do up to seven. Oh, it's optional. It's optional. Oh. 18 minutes. I'm ready to release my book now. Horrible. Uh, oh, no. Okay, I have to write a description of that. Okay, just to be sure. Oh, just, just I, 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 I show you. Actually, this is the chart of the books that I sold in the last 90 days. <laughs> it's, it's surprising that people buy this. <laughs> full stack DevOps. That I, 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 I'll be honest. This book, full stack, it's 120 pages and it's completely written by ChatGPT. <laughs> I, mean, I, I made at least I made back. I broke even because I made back the money for the subscription cost of ChatGPT. Um, this one is written mostly by me. I mean, it contains the seed prompt that I taught you today and yes, uh, yesteryear. Um, and it has a lot of great prompts, actually. But uh, the conclusion, again, is written by ChatGPT. A treatise mostly written by me. Conclusion by ChatGPT. And, and people are actually buying it. I, I don't know. Why would you buy that? Um, I, I, I probably made, I don't know, um, not more than $50 for the last year. But if you imagine, because that, that's just, my bookshelf is just, um, let me just go back to my bookshelf. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven books. $50. So if you scale it up to 700 books, that's like 50, 50 times 100. That's $50,000. That's, that's, right? Is it? $5,000. $5,000. Yeah, you, you can do maths. Um, that, that, that's quite good. I mean, I, and, and it's, 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 um, it's a good uh, side hustle. Yeah, right? Okay, so now we have the, uh, this one finished. Okay, let's just go up there, 16 minutes. No pressure at all. God, why, why is this one so long? Okay, so let's go back. Let's write the text, uh, chapter three. I still forgot to kind of... Mm -hmm. Chapter three, do the conquest of India. And yeah, I'm not gonna, not gonna worry about that. So let's just do chapter four. And before I do chapter four, um, maybe let's stop at chapter four and I just write up the conclusion, skip the, skip the other one. Or wait, let me just, just do it like that. Okay, it's fine. Uh, no. Mm -hmm. Chapter four, chapter five. Let's enter this one. Did I do that before? Yes, I did. Okay, let's rinse and repeat. Chapter, chapter four. So still one chapter to go with the conclusion and uh, offers forward. Okay, so this will take time again. I actually, it's, it's writing a lot of words, so I'm surprised that it actually just keeps writing it. Well, I, I, I get dizzy when I look at that, that that way. So let's just 
I think this is this is here almost finished. Yeah, this talk is not as uh, dynamic as last time because uh, we do have a lot of uh, dead time during the writing when 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 ChatGPT is writing. Oh, so many words! Stop already. We don't need that much. <sighs> okay, I think I think it wants to continue gen generating the text. Okay, let's just let it do that. Forty minutes. Oh my god. Okay, so that's it. Okay, I'm gonna skip the conclusion. I'm going to put it in there. No, it's chapter four. I'm going to enter the text. Leave everything else. Go up to the chapter four. Add the name of the chapter. And then go to the chapter five. And then re rinse and repeat again. Uh, what was the five? Last one. And then we finish that last one with a conclusion. So let's just get rid of that. Let me just copy that first so we don't waste time. All right. Uh -huh. I think I forgot some aesthetics. This one I forgot. Let's, uh, let's put it there. It's actually quite irrelevant, but okay. You don't want to. Mm -hmm. Okay, I, I'm going to leave it. <laughs> Nobody's going to care, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, so that, I mean, I mean, like, the purpose of this talk is about how to write books very quickly. You know? it's, it's not about quality. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now we're finished with chapter five, and now we're going to go to conclusion. And let me just get rid of this so we have no dead space here. Now, conclusion. Okay, conclusion doesn't have to have a subtitle. Okay, so given the book content that you wrote so far, write up an, uh, conc a conclusion that summarizes uh, this book. Mm, write it with uh, with uh, about mm, let's just say 500 words. Probably probably would be enough a thousand words maybe. Okay. Okay, it will take a little bit. 11 minutes. Wow, this is exciting, huh? Are you gonna try it out today? I'm actually teaching you to become my competition. <laughs> so, <laughs> you realize that. Okay, so let me just... Uh, okay, it's a little bit slow. Let me prepare for the next prompt. So the next prompt is, I think I have it here. Offer forward, yeah, at the end. Please write offer forward about 500 words. Let me just prepare that. I want to publish that book uh, description. Yeah, I need a I need a description as well, and the keyword is optional, so I don't I skip that one. Yo, okay. I should have written 500 words instead of a thousand. Okay, so now it's done. Conclusion is done. Ah, uh, good old copy paste. Copy paste. Okay, finish. So. Right now we're finished with the book. Now we just go, go up to the forward. Oops. Go up to the forward. Come up to the top. Up to the forward. And enter text. I already prepared that. Enter text. So I am. Oh, oops. So, okay. So we have offers forward. 
until we are ah, already copy pasted that. <sighs> now you realize that you can ah, sorry, you realize that you can change. You can use the same prompt that I, I'm using, just change British Empire to whatever else you want to do, right? Like Chinese Empire, you know, like um, Aztec Empire, and it's, it's, it's going to give out the book. It's crazy. It's like you can reuse that. I, 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 I can actually sell my prompts. It's crazy, right? Cause, because these prompts, you can reuse them. Now imagine in the future, maybe there's going to be a library of prompts that I, uh, people are selling to each other. So this, I, I'm foreseeing an industry here. So let me, just, uh, let me just put it here. So this is the forward. I'm going to move that up a little bit. OK, maybe you can't do that. So let me just, uh, OK, so OK, now it's done, finished. Oh, wait, wait, um, table of content. Let me just refresh that. Update table of content, entire table of content, eight minutes. OK, so this is, this is fine. I'm going to change that font to a little bit less than that so you can see everything on the same line. OK, perfect. Now it's done. What do we do? We are going to export that into a PDF. We are going to put it into Slava, Life British Empire. Here we go. And we are going to Kindle Create, because we need to do that because of the formatting issue. You have to format it uh, for Kindle properly. So that's why um, you have to do that. Um, let me just go up there, copy paste the, where is the title? Ah, here we go. Copy paste that, copy paste my name. No, I can type out my name. <laughs> OK, <laughs> I'm going to type out, oh, I just cut it over with it. So here we go. Choose the file, PDF, uh, live uh, history. OK, perfect. Now, just a quick check if everything is fine. It's uh, in total 57 pages. It's larger than the book that I wrote before, so it's, it's fine. I'm going to export it. I'm going to save that in the same folder. I'm going to be OK with that. And now let's go back to the folder, and let's see. OK, so here, here is the Kindle book in .kpf um, format. OK, now we can upload that into, into R. Ah, OK. I, I'm going to let ChatGPT write the ch description, because I'm, I'm kind of lazy. Let's just write the description for me. Here's the prompt to write the description. Ah, no, no, no. I, I put the prompt into the description. <laughs> that, would be, that would be bad. That would be hilarious. <laughs> OK. Great audience, uh, you, you, are, you, 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 you understand my humor. <laughs> like, I really like it. OK, uh, book description, title, for centuries, da 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 OK, discover, bite. Oh, uh, no, oh, no, I don't want to be too pushy. So I'm going to be, OK, put it up there. So here we go, it's formatted as well. I, uh, da da da. OK, save. Now we're going to continue, now we have six minutes. It's like running a sprint. Um, OK, I can add some digital rights. Yeah, fine. I upload the manuscript. Um, where is my manuscript? Uh, here. I upload it in the uh, KPF file format. I um, take some time. And we already pre prepared the uh, cover. So let's upload that later on. Obviously, you, you, if you have more time, you can do a better cover. You can you know, generate more options pay somebody on Fiverr, you know. Don't kill all the jobs, please. <laughs> Don't. Uh, launch cover. Uh, so that will take some time. OK, from, from computer, I'm going to click on that. And now I'm uploading that cover to Amazon. And it's going to generate some f template for me. I'm going to just choose one of those. Um, usually, this is a crazy one. Like who would do it? Oh my God! No. Okay. I, I'm gonna. I'm just. I'm just gonna do, do 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 this. Maybe this one is good. Yeah. History of the British Empire from the viewpoint of the conquered. Ah no. Like, let, let's add some credibility to this. MBA. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
maybe people are just buying it because of the title. Eh? So I'm going to save that. I'm going to, OK, preview. Uh, it will take some time to upload the whole thing. Four minutes, 52 seconds, 51 seconds, 50 seconds. Save and submit. If I can't get this under 20, 35 minutes, it's not my fault. It's the internet, OK? <laughs> Definitely the internet. OK. <laughs> what is the, OK, so now, now here you have to be honest, because uh, you have to declare if you used AI or not. So Amazon is collecting information about AI. So yes, I did collect, uh, use AI. I used AI for text, the entire work. <laughs> <laughs> With minimal editing, OK? <laughs> Chat GBT. And image, OK, I did only one image, which is the cover with minimal editing, which is I'm using leonardo.ai. Translation, I have none. It's in English. Uh, I have to do it because of ex experience. Like, if you don't do it, it doesn't go. It's not optional. They, they, they did it wrong. Um, OK, launch preview, I don't have to do that. I can do a quality check, but I don't have time. So let's <laughs> save and continue. <sighs> OK, so now we, have, uh, we, we can enroll it to KDP Select, which is uh, you get paid per page view. I can tell you that, don't do that. It's, 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 you, don't, you, don't, you don't get much money. Like, it's horrible, horrible payout. Um, so I want it to be actually, I want to get less percentage on the royalty because, simply because I prefer a lower price, right? So I, I can just add $1.99. Uh, Dollars and I get for each book I sell on Amazon Kindle 0 0.70 uh, 70 cent, right? Okay, so now you'll see all the prices on every single major Amazon market and the royalties you're gonna get. So now I'm okay with that. I'm gonna click on publish the book and come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, it's finished. So it's su successfully published, but it's, uh, it will go undergo a review process which will typically take 24 hours, 42 hours, and then you can make money out of it. So, okay, that's it. Um, I'm gonna stop here, and I'm gonna take your questions. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Let's pop them up. We still have some time. Yeah. I am curious how you check potential hallucinations in your book. That was going to be my question. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, obviously now I don't have the time here, but uh, when you are at home and you have enough time, you check uh, the hallucination by uh, you know, doing Google search. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's what I do. I, I, I search on Google, I search on Wikipedia and do all the fact checks. Uh, and it's going to take a while for a book of that uh, 50 pages, but this is what I do. Okay. Mm -hmm. A logical one. What about copyright, quotations, references, citations used from other book sources? Is ChatGPT reliable in this? Uh, it, it's absolutely not reliable. Yeah. <laughs> so you, can, you cannot rely on ChatGPT. Even if you give the prompt, please uh, cite everything you do. Uh, sometimes it does cite what it does, but then you copy the link into your browser and it fails. It's the wrong link. It's just fabricated it. Yeah. So I, I, I would say this is a tough one. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm not a lawyer, so I can't say the legal aspect, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I've just taken the one that's, that's folded yeah, up. Yeah. Uh, when most of the content is produced by Gen AI, what's next? What will LLMs learn from who will create something new? Where does it all go? Uh, so I, I've, I heard from a report, I'm not sure if that is true, data backed, but I heard uh, the internet is already, uh, a, a large percentage of it is already, uh, the content is already generated by AI. So it's, it's a big problem, because then uh, obviously why are we humans here? And, and what's the additional value of human writing? Um, I don't have an answer to that. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm just showing you that it's possible and that there is a danger, obviously, to, to artists and to lit uh, uh, you know, literature work, uh, writers, uh, authors, etc. It's a huge danger. And you're going to have huge competition with a lot of people because they can just write a book under 30 minutes. So, yeah. Okay, makes sense. Do you think... It is moral 
is it not a bit of a scam and should not be labeled as AI generated? Yeah, I mean, obviously, I, I also feel bad about this, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> we can see. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I, mean I, I don't feel this is uh, correct, honestly, uh, but I, I just want to show you that it's capable and, you know, um, whether it's moral or not, I'm, I, cannot, I cannot answer that. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Why do you use Leonardo? In st uh, because ChatGPT can also. Uh, because it actually generates better pictures. That's the only reason. Okay. Yeah. So for now, at least. Yeah. This is good. We're answering questions as quick as we wrote the book. This is yeah. good. Yeah. Uh, doesn't continue generating stay in the text of chapter four. Oh, sharp well, cookie. Sharp cookie. Generating stay in the chapter. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's why you don't re do the review. You didn't do the review. It's all on the internet now. So I, <laughs> yeah, I am uh, okay. And then well spot. This one you answered, I think. Was it fifty dollars that you made off Amazon so far? Uh, I I think it's approximately fifty dollars for the last year. Yeah, since yeah. I started the project. Big spender. Uh, yeah. yeah. Make it rain. Make it rain. <laughs> okay. Here and now we're going in. Uh, uh, so George Martin uh, began writing Winds of Winter back in 2010 and is still struggling with the manuscript. I, yeah, I think it will help him, to be honest. It will, will, I mean, uh, he, you, you can generate some ideas with ChatGPT, like a sparring partner, and then you can write it yourself, obviously, 100%, but you can generate ideas with it. I, I think it will actually help him. Yeah. yeah. Like Google Gemini, fact check. Uh, Google Gemini is the same uh, kind of hallucination as ChatGPT. I don't think you can do that. Uh, it's, it's not a good idea. Um, would you try to copy paste part of the book to Quill AI detector? Uh, yes, I do sometimes. Um, uh, there is actually a prompt to, buy, uh, to, to basically tell ChatGPT to write in such a way that the AI detectors cannot detect it. <laughs> <laughs> and and I, I, have it, I have it in the book. Uh, where is it? Ah, it's sold out. <laughs> <laughs> But, but I, I mean, just, just a plug, um, I, I do have printed out those books, uh, so I can sign them today, if you want. There you go. Uh, you know, I, I feel, I feel, thank you. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I, I feel great about the audience, so I initially I wanted to charge $15 per book, but that, yeah. I, I'm going to do it for free today. Okay, so nice. I, I'm going to be here, I'm going to sign it. Yes. And I, and I, yeah. Coming to this, the next question, why should yeah. anyone bother reading a book nobody could be bothered to no, write? No, 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 Th this book, I wrote it myself. Okay. No, no, I, like, <laughs> mo mo most of it is uh, written by myself. It's just a translation, okay? And, and this one, uh, actually 99% is myself, just the conclusion is, is not, it's not. But um, this is actually, I, I've spent a year of writing this, actually. Uh, yeah, so, yeah, t take a look. I mean, it's for free anyway, so. Yeah. Do you feel that room? Everybody's like, yeah, you did, you did it. Really. <laughs> you did it really. <laughs> okay. How are we on timing? Because we don't have the timer here looking uh, at the crew. Time's up, but yeah, depends on. I mean, what, what time is it? Let's see. Normally, I have a timer saying 2022. Ah, oh, we got one more. We have a okay, sensitive question. Mm -hmm. What is the business financial potential of creating such books? I assume it's heavily dependent on the topic. I assume that it's also a highly competitive market, and the crucial point is to find a perspective perspective niche? I mean, Amazon, uh, you know, you saw it on the Amazon forum. It actually asks you whether you use Jenny AI. So I presume that it will tell the r prospective reader and buyer that it's, you know, how much it is generated by AI. And depending on that, uh, the buyer would decide whether I want to buy this book or not, right? So, yeah, this is, this is going to have huge financial implications, I would say. Yeah. Okay. Next one. I think we already, do you think the general will even more polluting information? Yeah, probably. Uh, actually, it's, it's a better pollution than, than before, right? Because now you have a properly written text. Oh, yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> so may, maybe it's better to write Leonardo so, so he can design the cover for the book and then continue to pursue. I, didn't, I don't understand that. Maybe it's better to write Leonardo as ChatGPT so that he can design the cover for the book. Oh, you mean like writing the, the prompt? Yeah, I mean, that you have to experiment that on, on the prompts, yeah. I use ChatGPT to brainstorm topics. Yes, I do. And it's, it works really well. I, I actually, with the newest uh, feature in ChatGPT, you can, when you, when you have the paid account, um, there is a continuous voice mode. And when I'm in a car, I just ask it continuously, like, what can I write about next? And it's actually, it's great. All right, yeah. let's do one more and then we'll wrap it up. Yeah. Do you actually own the rights to this book? I'm not a lawyer, 
So I decline to answer that. I, I don't. Okay. I don't. I, I don't think um, it's a gray area right now. Yeah. I think yeah. we'll see. If you're here next yeah. year, we know it's okay. I mean, if, if I'm if not, <laughs> yeah. And we're live from jail in Germany, <laughs> off yeah, Austria. 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 Please, Austria. please don't sue me. No. Okay. There you go. <laughs> we're not going to sue you, but we're going to give you a big round of applause. Yeah, thank thank you, you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.